on my presentation and should have just gone in for the kill. But I've learned my lesson. The juvenile me is no more. I'm reborn as a killing machine! Oh. Alright, this was your decision. Okay. Shu? Wait, where's Inori? She's back at the house. So, what happened? Look, Sota, I'm sorry, but I can't help with Inori anymore. <laughs> oh, I get it. You're going after her now, too, huh? <sighs> If that's how you feel, why didn't you say something? I even asked if there was anything between you. I don't understand you at all. What the hell? Like you're one to talk. You're so damn pushy and loud and clueless all the time, Soda. Seriously, you bugged the crap out of me. Sorry. But that's really how I feel, okay? He must hate me now. Can't blame him. But I'm glad I told him, at least. It was the right thing to do. I thought that might be the case. What? Hey, thanks for giving it to me straight. Because sometimes you can be kind of distant. You know what I'm saying, dude? Anyway. Hell, if we're being honest here, sometimes you bug the crap out of me. It's cool that you told me. It means a lot, for real guess that we're friends at least a little bit, or why bother? It's a little late to be asking, but what exactly are voids anyway? I don't really understand what they're all about yet, but I think at some point I'm gonna have to. I should know. I mean, I'm reaching in and touching their hearts. Guy told me they change. Just like a person's heart can change, their void changes too. He said that? Guess that's good to know. So... If I form a bond with someone, does that mean my power will change too? <laughs> <laughs> 